In this Linux tutorial video, I'll be showing you how to set up DHCP within DNS Mask. Now, DNS Mask is the domain name server I have opted to use for NoTrack. So what DHCP does is allocate all your systems on your network with an IP address, and it also tells them how to get out to the internet. You can tell it to use the NoTrack IP address for the DNS server, so you don't have to mess around setting up any of the DNS settings on your computers. It's pretty much, you plug a computer in on your network, and it's already protected straight away. So it's quite handy. So we need to edit the DNS mask config file. So that's sudo, and you can choose your favorite text editor. My preference is nano. So it's slash etc slash DNS mask dot conf, and you can press tab to auto complete. Now there's quite a lot in this file. So I'm going to press control W to do a search. And I'm looking for DHCP hyphen range. So the notes on here say, uncomment this to enable the integrated DHCP server. You will need to supply the range of addresses available for lease and optionally a lease time. And a whole load of other instructions aren't particularly necessary. So DHCP range. So you set this for your network. So mine is 192.168.62. Now I'm going to start the range from 100. And I'm going to go through to 62.254. And I'll set the least time as 24 hours. So there's a whole load of other settings here, but these aren't particularly relevant. I'm just going to do a search for the next one I want. The next option I want is DHCP hyphen option equals three. Uncomment that. So option three is the internet gateway, or the IP address of your router. Next option, which this might be enabled by default, is log-dhcp, so just delete the hash next to it if it is commented out. And the last one is dhcp-authoritative, so uncomment that, and that'll do initially. So. Control X, Y, file name's right, yes, that, press enter. Then type in sudo service DNS mask restart. So that'll restart DNS mask and enable the DHCP server. Now next I'm going to go across to another system. So I've got Windows 7 running here in a virtual machine. So in Windows I can type in ipconfig slash all and get the details about the hardware MAC address and the IP address being used. In Linux the command is ifconfig. So I'm going to set a static IP address. So I'm going to take note of the physical address here in Windows. Another way of finding out the hardware MAC addresses of the systems attached to your network is to look in the DNS mask log file. So you can type in cat slash var slash lib slash misc slash DNS mask dot leases. That gives you the information there. Another way, if you've got no track, the DHCP leases page will now become available. So that says the same information there. So go back into editing DNS mask. And I press Control W to search for DHCP hyphen host. That's the line I'm looking for here. So I've got an example there above. So let's type in DHCP host equals now the MAC address of the system you're trying to allocate the IP address for. So let's double check that. So 08002767E6E3E. So then press comma and the IP address you want to allocate it. I'm just trying to think of an empty IP address. Uh, let's give it 99. So control X, Y, yes, write that file. And then restart DNS mask. And restart Windows as well. Although it's probably quicker just to flush the network settings. Oh, never mind, I've done it now. Now you can see the IP address has been set to the dot ninety nine. Now let's make a bit more use of this by adding the machine name into the 
local host file on the DNS server. So go across to the etc folder and type in sudo touch localhost.list. This file will already exist if you're using no track. So back to the config file for DNS mask. Now go to uncomment this line here or add it if you don't have it. ADDN hyphen hosts equals forward slash etc forward slash localhosts dot list. And save that, control X, Y. So sudo nano slash etc slash localhosts dot list. So you type in the IP address of the system, tab, and then, the, then the name you want to give it. So that Windows system is called Duff, and I'll just give it the address on my website. So duff.quidsup.net. Now this system with the dot .247 is the DNS server. So control X, Y, yep. Yeah. And do sudo service DNS mask restart. So ping wserve.quidsup.net. Oh look, it goes straight to the dot .247. And same in reverse, except it's not pinging. Funny that was the IP address I allocated it, didn't I? 62.99. Uh, maybe it's a firewall setting. Don't know of Windows. Anyway, that's the theory of it. That was how to set up DHCP in DNS Mask. Thanks for watching, I'll see you all later.